out of pressure. You know, you want to be the best you can be out there. So, you know, I'm just trying to get myself in as much shape, and we all trying to get ourselves in as much shape, as, best shape as we can for the season to play against any type of offense. How good can this defensive front be? Uh, it seems like it's going to go possibly 9 to 10 games. And we could be as good as we want to be. <laughs> we could be as good as anybody has ever been here. I mean, I really love this D-line. We work hard. We, we, we communicate great to, with each other. And it's just a, a, a great feeling to be with, around each other every day because I know the man next to me bringing his all. He know I'm bringing my all because he bringing his all. You know, nobody letting each other down. When you see that much potential, it almost makes you work a little bit harder just yeah. because you see what the end result can be. You have to. I mean, you got you, you got this man next to you. He want to play. You want to play. Y'all want to be a part of this team. You know what I mean? Y'all all, all want to contribute. And so you want to work your tail off. You know you. everybody on the line has the ability to play. So if you want to play, you make you show you show the people around you on your defensive line that it's important to you. And we, we pro, you probably going to be on the field. <laughs> I mean, we all can play. We're not stingy with time. We just want people on the field that's going to make do the right thing. and do, We can count on them. When you've got that many people that can't play, you do need that comp competition. Right. Show it. Show you deserve to be on yeah, the field. Yeah, exactly. You got it, yeah. You because it's a lot of people out there. You know, it's a lot of it's a lot of players. So you got to find the ones that want it the most, that want it, at, and think it's most important to them. Because it's important to the coaches. Are oh, you good? You've been around here a longer, probably longer, you were here a while back to see the, the evolution of how this defense has changed from when you were freshman here to now. What's right. the, what are the biggest differences in the way you guys play? Uh, biggest differences in the way we play. Just the way, um, just like the style, of the way you guys. Back then, it seemed like um, the big guys they would play through the through the nickel and all that too. We we kind of we kind of got a more of a rotation now. Seemed like, but back then they 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 used to stay in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean, but it, it was good. It, either way, it was good. Do you like the way it, there's a lot of, a lot of bodies coming in and out? Yeah, I, I love it now. I mean, because I liked it back then, but now it's just we have so many people that we never get really we never get exhausted out there. We plan our tails off, and we get to play every each play with 100 percent because you know the guy, we got a man behind us can you know come in and help do the same thing. I know it was like it, there was never any bending, you know, bend but don't break. It was kind of kind of was it maybe more of a thing last year. Is it is that more of a focus? It's like you're, you're not even going to bend anymore. No, nah, we ain't even trying to bend. We're trying to be still curtain. We trying to really make history. And do you think that's that's possible with this defensive line? I do. What gives you that confidence? I might be a, a bold statement, but man, I just, I really, really love my D line and I really appreciate them. You know what I mean? I really know that they're working their tails off and it's going to pay off. Could this team defense be better than the 2011?